Hey, what's going on guys? Chris back with you with another review video. This one I'm super stoked on because we have a full motion television mount. Hey guys, if you're new here, welcome. We have a lot of fun here. Smash that subscribe button down below and turn on your bell notifications so when fresh content comes out, you're the first to know. Swivel, tilt, pull out, push back into the wall, you name it, this bad boy has it. The company is Mounting Dream. I'll have it linked in the description box below, the first link. For you guys in the UK, if they sell it in the UK, I'll have you guys linked as well. This thing has all the bells and whistles. This particular one by the company we're gonna be reviewing is for 42 inches up to about 70 inch televisions. All the specs will be in that link in the description box below. Anything I don't cover, go ahead and check that link for specific specs that I might not cover. What's awesome is that this particular one, we're going up to 24 inch studs. They also make one that's up to 16 inch studs so you can find the right hole pattern for your wall and for your mounting on the back of your television. And please stay tuned till the end of the video because we do have a giveaway. The company has reached out and they're going to be giving you, the viewers, a chance to get your hands on one for free. So stay tuned till the very end. This particular model is the MD2198. It can hold up to a 100 pound television. Not too many televisions are upwards of 100 pounds except for the older ones. Once you take the stand off of it, that eliminates the weight upwards of sometimes 15 to 20 pounds alone for a stand. Depends on your TV, of course. So let's head downstairs to the man cave, which I've nicknamed the can cave, and let's go mount this bad boy and put up a TV. So we're in the man cave right now, and we're going to get to that in just a second here, but this thing comes again, like I mentioned, with all the bells and whistles, instructions, even an HDMI braided cable right there, level Velcro straps for your cable management, your rear brackets for your television, all your hardware, Allen wrenches, nuts and bolts for the different size mounting hardware there, and of course, some washers and spacers, etc. for all the different TVs another very small mini level, and a mounting template if you need to go that route as well. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the Man Cave, a.k.a. the Can Cave. We got bicycles hung up, we got televisions, we got a 65-inch, we got a 50-inch, and we're looking at the mounting dream right over here on the right-hand side for our third television, which is right over here. So we're going to be putting that one on this one. Let's take a closer look at it. Absolutely solid features. So first off, it lays very very flat against the wall. Those full specs will again, of course, be in the link below. Very easy to mount as well. Let me show you again a couple of awesome features. It's full swing, full tilt out, meaning that we can bring it all the way over each direction. I'll get some shots of that with the TV hung in just a little bit here. But what's awesome as well is let's say you've hung it, obviously use your level for the back there. But let's say you've hung it and it's just, it's off a little bit. What's really nice is there are some Allen screws right here that you loosen and that will give you a negative or plus 3% tilt this direction if for some reason it's off. They've thought of it all. Some tightening hardware for your tilting. Once you have the desired tilt, you go ahead and tighten these guys here. And let's also say that you've mounted it on the wall and you're like, oh no, it should have been over a little bit. I've actually had that issue before. And so what's nice about that as well you loosen these guys here and these guys here on both sides. There's a couple more over there and down below. And that whole entire back bracket will slide up and down this section here. So look at all this room you have here and over there on that side if the TV is not in the desired place that you want it which is a great feature. All right, we are mounted and looking fantastic. Now again, remember, if you're trying to line it up, obviously the back brackets, raise those up that are mounted to the back of the TV and then clip it back on. I do need to adjust that so we have a little bit more, less of a gap from there because the 50 inch over here is kind of seamless as we can see here. So I'm just gonna have to raise those brackets up, no worries at all, but again, I'm very stoked on how I could slide it, loosen it up and slide it because where I have it mounted on the wall, I actually needed to push it over to the right a little bit, so that made it very easy. Overall, I'm super pumped on it. It was so easy because I already did have a mount up here already. I was able to install this thing very, very quickly. But let's go ahead and look at the back a little bit closer. So once you do hang the television here, you have your clips right up here. Then you just install the little bracket here that has two screws here and here on each side. And so you are fully dialed in, not worrying about that coming off the television at all. Absolutely fantastic. Go ahead and tilt it again with those Allen screws again. And again, if you do need to slide it like I did here, just loosen up these, all four of those, 
and the whole thing will push back and forth. I loosened those, I did not remove those completely and I was able to slide the television. Just be careful and have a spotter because we do not want to crack any television. So what I really like about the full range motion is that I can come over here and I can tilt it so it's a little bit more angled here so that when I am viewing the 65 and I have the other one over here to the right hand side, I can have that tilted for more of an in-depth gaming situation here. I do not have a full motion on this one. That is the next step, as you can see there, that's flat against the wall. So I would also need to angle that one, angle that more into the right, into the 65 inch, as this one is here for a full immersing gaming experience. Then of course, if you're not familiar with full range motion, it can come this far out from the wall. Again, the full specs are in the link below if you want the precise dimensions, but it's nice and far. We'll fold up flat, and then also with full range, you're able to angle the television so that you can pull it out and it can really face this direction. Let's say if you're doing a garage workout or if you're upstairs and you're working in the kitchen, you wanna angle your television and it can do it obviously the other side as well, flipping it over to the other direction. Tilt, down, back up. Overall, very, very easy to mount, a great mount. Let's head upstairs and let's go ahead and give you the full details on the giveaway. All right, so the rules for the contest are gonna be this. Two folks will be receiving free mounts and three folks will be receiving mounts for 50% off. Now you will need a PayPal account and I will forward your information to the company because you will need to actually purchase the mount first and then the company will give you a PayPal refund. So two of you will be getting it for free, but you will need to pay for it first and three of you will need to pay for it first and then they will be refunding you via PayPal for 50% of your purchase price discount. So hopefully that made sense. You will be receiving it for free, but you will need to pay for it and they will refund you via PayPal and they'll take care of it. So Chris, how do we win? So if you haven't already, subscribe to this YouTube channel. The button is right below the video there. Subscribe to this YouTube channel and then go to the description box of this video, which is right below, and you'll see my Instagram link. Head over to my Instagram, go ahead and follow me on Instagram, and then just go on my newest picture that I just posted, and go ahead and comment, say that I want a free mount. So the first two that say I want a free mount will receive free mounts, but you will need to purchase it, and then again, get a refund via PayPal from the company. And then you'll be able to see in the comments the people that have one already. And then if you're interested, the next three people that comment, I'd like one for 50% off. Then you get one for 50% off as well. So if that sounds like a plan, if you're willing to do that, you have an opportunity to get a free mount or one for 50% off. So just subscribe to this YouTube channel, follow me on Instagram, comment on my newest post, and make sure you have a PayPal account so you can get your refund. Don't let the party stop, guys. Hit one of these videos, continue to watch, and we'll see you soon. Mm -hmm.